Good afternoon students, welcome to the class. In today's video, we will understand what are vacuoles and what are their functions. Okay, let us start it. Vacuole is a membrane bound cell organelle that exists both in plant and animal cells. And if you guys are not familiar with the term organelle, let me make you understand. Organelle is a subset or we can say is a subunit of a cell that has a specific function to perform. It is more like our organs in the body. For example, heart has a function to circulate blood, oxygenated blood throughout our body, while kidney, they filters out the waste from our body. Similarly, we have other organs that are specified, that are specialized to perform specific function. Similarly, within a cell, we have different subunits that we call as organelles that perform specific function within a cell and vacuoles are one of them. The term vacuole is derived from Latin word Vacuous, that means empty. What they contain? These organelles are filled with water containing organic and inorganic compounds. And these compounds are responsible for the growth of the plant. That we will understand later on in this video. The vacuoles have no specific shape and its shape depends on the requirement of the cell. If the requirement is more, we will see vacuoles larger in size, while on the other hand, if the requirement is less, we see small sized vacuoles. Let us proceed. What are the specific functions of a vacuole? Their main function is to get rid of the waste product. They take in the waste product within a cell and get rid of that. The waste product can be water. Therefore, vacuoles help in maintaining the water balance within and outside the cell. Vacuoles take in the toxin material and convert them into simpler compounds that do not affect the functioning of the cell. They also provide structure in a plant cell. Although we see vacuoles both in plant cell and animal cell, but there is a striking difference in their sizes. While we see vacuoles of smaller size and multiple vacuoles in animal cell, but we see large vacuoles in a plant cell. Vacuoles in a plant cell, let us understand more about vacuoles in a plant cell. Vacuoles in a plant cell are large in size and they generally occupy over 50 to 90 percent of the cellular volume. They support the structure of the plant, helps in germination of the plants by providing water and also provides protein to the seeds for their growth. Now my question is, why do we see large sized vacuoles in plant cell? What is the reason behind this large size? The reason is plant cell lacks a well-defined excretory system and due to this the waste products get stored inside their bodies temporarily and sometimes permanently and therefore we need a large mechanism large system that should be big enough to manage this waste product and get rid out of the cell and this large size vacuole takes in the waste product now you can see that these blinking dots represents the waste product. This waste product is taken in by the vacuole and after taking in the waste product, this vacuole breaks down them into smaller and simpler compounds. So this is the mechanism that vacuole does. It takes in the waste product inside it and breaks it down into simpler and smaller compounds. Another function, it contains growth nutrients like proteins, fats, carbohydrates for the growth and germination of the plant. It also provides turgor to the plant cell. Turgor, I mean to say rigidity to the plant cell. Let us understand how. When cell takes in water from environment or from the soil, the water gets into the cell and this water is taken in by vacuole also. And due to this, vacuole starts inflating and vac when vacuole inflates it creates hydrostatic pressure against the cytoplasm wall within the cell and due to this this cell starts expanding and that provides a well-defined structure to the plant so it is due to the inflation of vacuole that creates hydrostatic pressure within the cell against the cytoplasm wall makes cell to inflate and provides turgor or rigidity or a well-defined structure to the plant. Now we can see that the plant 
is in well defined structure due to optimum amount of water within the creates inflation within a vacuole vacuole creates hydrostatic pressure and is the wall of the cell and this gives rigidity turgor to the cell and overall plant as such on the other hand when there is lack of water within the cell or cell loses out water this causes shrinking of vacuole and shrinkage of vacuole reduces the hydrostatic pressure within the cell against the cytoplasm wall and when pressure against the wall reduces the cell starts shrinking leading to losing hydrostatic pressure results in loss of rigidity or turgor and we see a withering plant we also see specialized vacuoles in unicellular organisms like amoeba and paramecium food vacuole is one of them food vacuoles are specialized in storing food in these unicellular organisms while on other hand we have contractile vacuoles as the name signifies contractile vacuoles they contract when contains fluid within them and when fluids gets out of them they squeezes shrinks or contracts hence the name is given to them contractile vacuoles i hope things are clear to you let us now summarize the whole video membrane bound cell organelles exist both in plant animal and plant cells plant cells have larger vacuoles sometimes they are large enough to cover 50 to 90% of the total volume of the cell their main function is to get rid of the waste product the waste product can be water therefore vacuoles help in maintaining the water balance within the cell and also outside the cell the vacuoles take in the toxin material and convert them into simpler compounds they provide structure in a plant cell now there is a small quiz for you students kindly attempt it you can see the answers later on the first question for you vacuoles are the sub unit of a cell that has a specified function to perform is the statement true or false the vacuoles are larger in animal cells than that in plant cell true or false third one for you the vacuoles not only have a waste disposal mechanism but also contain nutrients for the growth of a plant true or false and the last one for you vacuoles provide turgor i mean to say rigidity to the plants true or false and your time starts now and the answers are i hope the whole video the concept of vacuole their function is clear to you if you find this video interesting kindly share among your friends and be tuned to this channel for more interesting updates i'll see you in the next video till then goodbye thank you very much and have a nice day